What are the qualities for you that make a great basketball player beyond just talent and skill set and size? Um, knowing the history of the game. Knowing the history of the game, knowing the ones that came before you, knowing the ones that paved the way, knowing the reason why you're actually having the ability to actually live out your dream. That doesn't happen without the people that came before you. It doesn't happen without Bill Russell, you know, going through what he went through during the civil rights movement and all those things, Oscar Robinson going on with what he had to deal with, you know, during those times. It does not happen if they're able to just be pure in who they are that allows us to now perform and do it with no care. Um, also, I think discipline at people, you know what, people use that word so loosely. What does it mean to you? You have to have the ability, when, you, when it comes to discipline, it's like you have to sacrifice loved ones. <laughs> you have to sacrifice loved ones for a long period of time if you want to be great. It is very unfortunate, and you feel it at times. You, you know, you know the saying: if if if, the, if if it's too hot, get the hell out of the kitchen. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta get out of the kitchen because it gets hot. But you have to have a discipline to sometimes you have to sacrifice loved ones in order to be great because they don't understand. And, and that's okay. They don't understand what it means to, like, I am getting up every single day at 5 or 6 a.m. And when I get home after everyone leaves the gym, I'm going to take a nap. So now you're sacrificing your loved ones because you're not spending time with them. And when I wake up, I'm probably going to train again. And then I'm going to have dinner. And then I'm going to bed. And I'm going to do that every single day for a long period of time.